Hello everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Invasio Barbarorum and we are literally about to end the turn so that Madron can build his little battering rams over here at Dalrider and so we can attack Dalrider again and crush the rebel scum so yeah let's go Was the thing correct? It was! We had a projected profits of 270 last turn, so turns out getting rid of that cavalry, as painful as it was, was actually worth it. We could probably stand to lose a few more, but still. Um, might get rid of some of these meditates, I don't know. Might be a unit of them? Yeah. Just gradually shaving off the military a bit here and there, you know, where we can afford to. Oh, well, Noble Master? guess this Constantini buggered off, I only assume maybe they lost the battle. Um, free people's navy. Talork, my god, I will destroy you one day. One day. Oh, and bri brilliant, a three-star Admiral Rigguard as well down here, pillaging his way across our shores. I will make some more pay, I tell you. Um, in the meantime, we're going to make someone else pay. In the form of Dal Rider. And hopefully once we capture this place, it'll put our economy back in the... back in a seriously profitable point, as opposed to right now where we're just about scraping by. Um, yeah, you get to Instruct Hill. That's increased the public order there slightly, which is good. Um, at least that place is turning a profit. It is turning a profit of 300. Although that said, that's probably because it's um, it's so tiny and therefore it's not taking a big uh, burden of the military costs. So, because the costs of the military are divided up by settlement according to the settlement size. So, Iburicum um, and um, Londinium. Well, hang on, that's just a large town. So, yeah, Londinium and Ventris Norma currently sharing the brunt of our um, upkeep costs at the minute, whereas, say, Iskasilurum doesn't have to deal with it quite so much. Neither does Biburicum and Instrut Hill better have to deal with it at all, because it has a population of 412. The place is practically a village now. So, um... Sir. Anyway... Attack. I'm tempted to auto-resolve this, because I kind of almost can't be bothered to do another siege all over again, but I don't think we will. I think we'll just go ahead and do it. I mean, because it does on the other hand, it just sort of almost doesn't matter how many guys we lose at this point, because once this is taken, it's taken, and there we go. Um, but that said, I do actually want to send these guys across the sea and attack Ireland as well, so maybe I shouldn't ought to resolve it. Well, let's get this over with then. Yeah, we've got 722 guys. That's probably just enough to fuck us up a bit on the auto resolve. So let's go on with it. To those that flee comes neither power nor glory. Well, judging by our experience with the Picts, I would have to agree. that Midrun the bowel weakener. Right, whoa, that's a bit laggy. Why am I getting so bad frames? What the hell's causing that? Something weird going on here. I'll tell you. Something around here causing my frame rate to drop. I don't know what the hell it is though.
Not very strange. No, it's all set to what I left it on. Peculiar. Oh, building details should probably be a bit lower because you don't need it as what you put it on, really. That's a little bit more like it. Anyway, um, it's mainly the, it's mainly the fault of this terrain, I think. Um, actually, the Rome is wrecked in battle. Yeah, it's on freaking highest. It should be on medium, for Christ's sake. Anyway, um, yeah, the Rome is wrecked in battle terrain. For as a word of warning for you guys, um, you know, if you're looking to install it, you do need a good PC to run the stuff. Um, it may not look terribly impressive, but because of the dated nature of Rome Total War's engine. Um, anything that you try to run in this which has better graphics than the original game it, it exponentially increases the amount of you know hardware performance you need to get in order to be able to run it so this might not look very impressive compared to say friggin Far Cry 3 or something um, but you will need a powerful computer to run the Roma Threat and Battle Terrain on good settings so just a word of warning because the the the, end, the game engine just isn't optimized properly to be able to run this kind of stuff. You know, it's it, it, it this at the minute it looks like very low res versions of the Shogun Two terrain almost. So, you know, and this was on a game that was released for single port single core CPUs back in the arse end of the two thousands. So, you know, just something to bear in mind. That's why I have a frame rate right now of barely about thirty or so. Um. When by all rights, I should be getting 60, like I do when I play Shogun 2. So, you know, so just just bear it in mind. Anyway, oh, we, well, apparently we didn't need rams because the wall's still damaged, even though the game said we needed rams. What kind of rubbish? They did they did repair the gate at least, I suppose, but still, mm. not impressed. Um, I'll get that ram over there. You guys can drop those rams. You guys can line up here. Manates, I mean pedates. Sorry, you get there. You go there. The drum. You can stand over there next to Senianus, I suppose. There we go. Pretty much the same setup as last time we took this bloody place. And, well, we're even attacking from the same freaking angle. Which is, um, in a way, sort of hilarious. Alright, let's see if we can kill some of these more bears. Let's get this battle underway. <sighs> I'm already running away. Guys, what are you trying to achieve here? I do not understand. Yes, that's more like it. This is all they've got. What have they got back to the town center exactly? Oh, a unit of these guys. Right, well. Clearly this is going to be a lot easier than it was the first time we took the place, but still. I think I'm just going to sit here and harass these guys with my horse after as long as possible. And uh, then we'll send our guys in. Oh, don't all run away. That's just boring. Ugh. Oh wait, some of them are coming back. Sweet. No, they're running away again. Bother. They could get a bit closer over here, but there's this tower over here which will just fill us, fill us with arrows um, if we get too close. So I'd honestly rather not tempt that, especially not with my Allens anyway. 
Right, well, sort this for a game of soldiers. Let's go. I don't think we're gonna, even going to need this battering ram here, really, are we? I'll keep it there just in case, but I don't think I'm going to need it. Off you go, Madron. I'm probably not going to send him to the middle of the town square this time, just because there's that unit of awkward bastard pikemen stood around here. Which would probably make a mess of his bodyguard, unfortunately. Hey, you're back. It's because you saw we were approaching the walls, didn't you? So you thought you'd send a token bunch of guys up here to try and defend it, but what a mistake. You fools. Oh, some other guys. Some Elbert Roo. Crossbow over there. Yeah, let's attack you, actually, because they could make life a little bit dis difficult for these approaching pedotes, actually. <laughs> if they start shooting through there. Because crossbows are quite powerful, needless to say, even these primitive picked ones. That's it, run away, flee for your lives. Or march for your lives, if you prefer. Still hit them from there? I'm impressed. Fair enough. As long as I keep running away, that's fine. And we're inside officially. Awesome. Oh, no, 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 no. Stay put. You're not going to go chase the crossbowman. Sorry, but you're not. Ah, yep, true to form. Here they come. Time for my horse arches to make their life a misery. There we go. You sure you guys really want to stand here and throw sticks? It's going to cost you dearly. No, they seem pretty intent on doing it. I might have to throw some sticks at them. As soon as you guys get your acting to gear. Yeah, there we go. Enjoy! With compliments from Madrun. Whoa, 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 whoa. Stop, 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 stop. Stop, stop. Don't end up shooting our own guys back, Stink, because I know you will. I said stop, you assholes! What part of... Did you not understand? Fuck it now. Damn barbarian mercenaries. So look at all these guys lying on the ground here, face first onto the ground. Those are the ones that got killed by the arrows. Jesus. Uh, never mind. Can't be helped, I suppose. You're banned from firing arrows now, guys, for the rest of the battle. I'm sorry, but you're banned. Wow, uh, they're just going to charge me. Instead of using their crossbows, fair enough. Now they are attempting to route through my men. Well, good luck.
Well, that's a problem that very much solved itself. <laughs> Alright, fellas, get over there. Um, send a couple of militaries over there. Reenact our disastrous attempt to take the uh, town square from last time, except hopefully this time it'll be more successful. But we might need more than that. Now I think about it. Okay, sending cavalry up there is a bit of a no no in support, so, um. Yeah, we might need an extra troop of infantry for each side. Speed it up. Oh, it's starting to get foggy again, wonderful. Right, guys, up here, please. You up there. Don't tr try to make too much of a mess of the pathfinding this time. If you can help it. They will probably send someone down to try and uh, deal with us on the way up here. Probably be these more mayors. Hence I sent the slightly better equipped penites up here instead of around there. Kind of irritating that while I'm moving the camera, it goes back to normal time speed. See, when I I'm perfectly still, I can't even look around. Like when I'm perfectly still, then it goes fast. I want to be able to look around while it's sped up. You stupid game. All oh, right, they're sending the game lawn, which is actually kind of good because if we can kill all them before we get to the town square, we might actually just be able to send some cavalry up here to finish these guys off instead of. Wasting our time with infantry. With horrible rubbish infantry, I might add. Whoa, 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 whoa. There we go. Come on, charge! <laughs> LOLS! <laughs> Physics for the win. Holy crap, they're pushing us back quite a bit. How are they doing that? Seriously. I was about to say I should form a shield wall, but I forgot I can't. Because the Romano British suck. Well, we're clearly winning. They're dropping like flies, so. 64, 62, 60, 59, 58, 57. That's what I like to see. How are you winded? You're just walking. For heaven's sake. Uh, half of you seem to have been insisting on jogging, while the other half of you are walking. Might be why you're winded. I don't know how I can solve that. I don't think I can. Oh, whatever. Look mighty impressive though. Don't lock them after all. Anyway. I 
So now they're sending the Dimba. Very well. Let's carve our way through them as well, even if we are very tired. The Dimba should be even worse in close combat than those game lore and worse, so. Even though there is a lot more of them. Stuck in. What are they doing? It's almost like they're trying to do a, a boar's head maneuver on us, except it's not really working. Now what the hell are they doing? Are they trying to throw javelins at us at point blank range? Cheeky shits. Well, well, they're trying to. It says they're reloading, so nothing's happening. They're just sort of standing there like lemons. Yeah, now they've given up. They also appear to be dropping like flies. Good. Breaking flee already. You're wavering. There we go. Maybe we throw, throw a few javelins at them. In passing, maybe. No. No, your pathfinding is too much of a mess for that, isn't it? Oh well, never mind. Just march over there. Guys, keep going, even though you're tired as hell. Oh, cheeky shit, so just throwing javelins at us from a distance now. Whatever, do it. For every one that falls, ten more tankies placed. Pretty much at this point. Jesus Christ, they're marching slowly. Seriously, look at that! It's like they're moonwalking their way to the town square. Fucking lord. What the hell, guys? Really? Ugh, whatever. At least your pals over here aren't ridiculously slow. Yep, that didn't take long, did it? You little shits. And I accidentally disabled the sound. Sorry, the um, I end up accidentally doing that every now and again. The, the disable sound effects button is Alt S, and Alt also happens to be the use alternate attack button. You hold that and you call it right click. So. Um, which I do quite often with these penates, just so that they charge into melee instead of trying to throw their spears first. Um, but unfortunately, because WASD is how you control the camera, that means I sometimes accidentally disable the uh, sound effects. 
kill these fucking momers, please. Better yet. Madron, Sonianus, come up here and do what you do is about best, you know. You might not even be needed, to be honest with you, though. They have them pretty handily outnumbered. Although I can already see these guys making a mess of us. Oh, damn, more mares. I hate them! I'm glad we'll soon be seeing the back of them for good, hopefully, at least. Provided they don't revolt again. There we go, some of the spearmen have managed to get to the front, therefore. They're doing a little bit more damage. Also, what's not helping is that we're exhausted and they're only warmed up, so... There goes one. And here come... Madrun and his pals. There he is. Second time you've had to do this, isn't it? Oh well. Ah! Come on, hurry this up. It's only like... There's nine of them. Come on, you can do this bit faster. These little shits need to die. They're annoying me more than anything else right now with this constant javelin throwing. in there. This is how a real cavalry fight you barbarian sons of pig dogs. Hi there. Go on, Sonianus. Kill some for me. Oh, and there's their general. Quick! Kill him! Is the standard bearer gonna get him? Hell yes, he did! Or was that. Oh my god, was, tell me that was Madrun. <laughs> we stood right next to him. It could have been him or the standard bearer. I'd be chuffed if, if it was him. Or Sonianus, since they both sat there having a nice chit chat while these Dimbo throw spears. Well, um, weather is kind of nasty today. Well, yes, yes, it is. Um, I say, old chap, should we do something about these, um, these picks over here? I don't, I don't know. We'll leave it to the militaries. They've, uh, they've gone all day, you know. No, come on, guys. Seriously. Kill them. I'd say this is very satisfying to watch. Hey, there we go. Whew. 221 dead. No better or worse than I think we would have got if we'd all resolved. So. Yeah. The town is ours once again. Yeah, most of that was fucking Pedita. It's probably the one that got shot at by the Allens. Yeah. Victory! 
Oh, I'm so going to exterminate you. 5,783 of the population are going to die, which leaves us with about 2,000 left. But I so don't care right now. There we go. Harsh times to harsh measures. The people have been put to the sword and now understand the price of defying Roman power. Mrah! There we go, we have all of Britannia to ourselves. At last. Sweet. And they're still fucking revolting, look at that. Jesus. Low tax rate. Holy balls, seriously. These little shits are not going to stop until I've murdered every single one of them, are they? Oh my god. Your Honor. I can only hope it improves later on. As the turns go by or something. I don't friggin' know. Maybe the unrest decreases. Because, uh. There's nothing we can do. Not until our debt's solved, anyway. Then we can build some more buildings and then we can. You know deal with the problem properly, but uh, until then, we're kind of just going to have to stand around. Let's merge. Oof, that was painful. We lost a lot of guys. Um, at least Inch Tortell is behaving itself. At least. Yeah, projected profit 7,000. Oh yes, but that was mainly from the loot we got from burning the place to the ground. Next turn it won't be so good at all. But that will taste down to minus 18,000 as opposed to minus 20,000. So, it's not so bad. Um, well. Sir. Keep going, Septimus. Cannot up do up that, that way. Yes. No more moves. I guess, uh, no I guess that's it for uh, this turn. I guess that's it for this episode as well, being in for like 30 minutes now, so... Yeah, well, we burnt down right into the ground for all the good in the world it did, which wasn't a great deal. Um, and, yeah, Britannia is now entirely ours, although I'm, I, I must have a feeling we'll have to deal with another revolt soon enough, because this place is just not giving up without a fight. So, in the meantime, thanks for watching, everybody, and I'll see you again pretty damn, damn soon. I imagine. So.